right, so we had we had another question. I know Sonia had her hand up, and then we'll go over to the issue of teaching has come up a couple of times already, and having four such experienced teachers here. And you all brought students who probably run dojos or groups themselves. It might be interesting to know what drives you as teachers or what you would give as advice to people who would like to follow this tradition. Yes, if you can't find anything better to do. <laughs> <laughs> you know, a lot of people think that in developing now I have to have a dojo and be a teacher. Uh, you know, I would like to see on television, on an interview program, some famous person being interviewed. Doctor, you're the greatest surgeon in the world right now. How do you account for it? And he says, I do Aikido. <laughs> Don't be so hot to open up a dojo and be a teacher and stuff. That's some people think that that's development, but if it doesn't work for them, if they're not inherently a teacher, it fails, and then they feel bad about themselves. Well, it's like, hey, that wasn't your lineage. You were attracted to the process of Aikido. Continue doing that and find out what your lineage is. The more of the process is not necessarily being a teacher in a dojo. Is that? Is that right? um, so, uh, the sensei taught a man, his name was Sadaharu O, most famous baseball player in Japan. And he was having a little trouble, he couldn't bat very well. And, uh, the batting coach for the Tokyo Giants was an Aikido student uh, when I was there. And the batting coach brought him to the Aikido to see if anything in Aikido could help. And anyway, Sadaharu met Osensei, and Osensei said, don't listen to these other guys, do this. And he had him do some type of process. Uh, involved a lot of standing on one leg, anyway. <laughs> Sadaharu O caught a fair amount of what Osenta is trying to say and was diligent with it. He really caught it. He became uh, the home run king of the world. Okay? He didn't open a dojo. <laughs> so find out what your lineage is and use the Aikido principles and your Aikido development, the alchemy of it, the dimensionality of it, to be a better whatever your real mission is. Okay? 